Okay, let's talk about Blastomyces dermatitis. Ta-da! So I'm looking at these cards and also Pygmonic and trying to see what I can pick up. So, um, one of the most important things here is that it is dimorphic, meaning that in cold temperatures at 25 degrees it exists as hyphae with small con uh, conidia. And at 37 degrees, thick walled budding yeasts within the body. So, fungi, which is uh, systemic. Let's talk about the uh, clinical case. A man from Missouri develops weakness in night sweats. His physician notes sores on the patient's skin, biopsy of the skin, uh, lesions reveal large budding yeasts. So, this BBB uh, broad based buds is a key here and you can see them right here these broad based buds and um, the doctor informs the patient of his rare yet serious diagnosis and begins a course of antifungals including amphotericin B so some of the main points here looking at pygmonic um, it's a round yeast uh, single broad based buds uh, thick doubly uh, refractive walls. Something you might see is pneumonia, uh, skin infections, uh, bone infections, and you'll find this um, in uh, Missouri area and the uh, Great Lakes area. Um, let's talk a little bit more about clinical presentation. So systemic infection, pneumonia. Again, we're seeing pneumonia. So, uh, pathobiology, the spores are found in the soil and are inhaled. And body temperature, the spores become yeast, unicellular yeasts, and there is a local lung infection. And uh, acute pneumonia, which is less common, um, or yeast spreads systemically over time. Granulomas form throughout the body, and they're... Uh, there are lesions in the lungs, bones, and the skin. These start as pimples and then become, read this word, uh, verrucous or ulcerative. So to diagnose this, uh, culture at different temperatures. So at 25 degrees, branched hyphae and single cells at 37 degrees. And you would take a tissue biopsy and look for those large budding uh, yeasts. Um, so for treatment, I use antifungals, um, itroconazole uh, for meningeal infections, and amphotericin B for non-meningeal infections. So quick facts. The systemic infection occurs in the absence of lung disease. Blastomycosis is the rarest yet most severe of the systemic fungal infections. Paracoxoidomycosis is a similar uh, fungal infection endemic to Latin America. However, it is distinguished by yeast with multiple buds, and it affects males much more than females. So remember that the uh, buds are attached to parent cells by broad bases. And uh, I think that uh, we can remember this uh, quite easily. Blastomycosis found um, east of the Mississippi River and Central America.